Tiffany, code red. What? Nothing? Nothing. Your sister's room? Why don't we just call your mom or sister? We should have done that first. <laughs> Tiff? Hey, buddy. Did you call or text? About that. Tiffany, we need to call your mom or sister. Yeah, negative. It's an emergency. We don't have any money to go buy anything. You're not supposed to be here. What? Remember when I was making faces behind Miss Soto's back in class the other day? Well, the school kind of called my parents and I'm... Grounded. Figures. No! What? Don't sit there. Not with all that going on in your downstairs. You'll leak. I'm not going to leak. I'm wearing a roll of toilet paper in my underwear. Ew, why would you do that? Health class, you dummy. Oh, yeah, forgot about that. Sorry. Tiffany, just call your mom or sister, please. I can't find my phone. What don't you understand about not having anyone over? If we call my parents, they'll only go on and on about how I never listen and I always want all of the attention all of the time. Plus, you'll never see me again. Trust me, at this point, that's the last thing I care about. Uterus? No, I broke my leg. Do you have something I can take? Crap. I guess you have to go to your dad then, right? Or not. Imagine how awkward that would be. There is one thing we can do. Tiff? Yeah? Pads are by the registers. Ow! Call your mom now. Grounded, remember? Not allowed to be out of the house, with the exception of school. Fine, then here's what we're going to do. Pay attention. Excuse me. Do you have a bathroom? Employees only. I started the Crimson Tide today. You know what I mean? My bleeding for JJ. Right this way. You know what? <laughs> False alarm. Bye. You said to run. No, I said when you saw me walking to the door directly, then leave. Oh. How my freaking uterus. You're both the worst kleptomaniacs ever. Klepto what? It means thieves, you idiot. <sighs> Crimson Tide? Really? You look a bit young to have a period. And FYI, I can see everything. All right. You still will have to wait here while I call your parents. Bathroom is off limits, unless it's a real emergency. Did your phone battery die? Well, why didn't you call me? Yeah, I know. All right, let's go through this step by step. So Tiffany's sister or her mom didn't have any pads. You both go to the store, but neither of you have any money. Mm-hmm. Even though I gave you lunch money for the week? Yeah. You mind telling me what happened there? I know Tiffany's mom gives her daughters money. Well, Tiffany forgot her money, so I bought her lunch. Oh. That's very sweet of you. It was either that or her stealing food from my tray. She's a thief. Sam, you let me know if you need anything, okay?
You don't have to steal. Juvenile delinquent. You should have called me earlier. You should have called me earlier. I know. Well, apparently you didn't know. You're lucky the lady at the store didn't press charges. I said I was sorry, Dad. I'm sorry. You're mad at me. No, I'm not mad. Well, I... you look like it. I know talking to me about this stuff is awkward and weird. Moms are better at it. Just get started on your homework. Dad. I'm sorry, Mom. So how's your vagina? Tiff! What, you seem better. Metal does you justice. You're making a mess. Hey, I've got a joke for you. What's a period? Well, you're supposed to say it. What, Tiff? What's a period? A period is when a woman's uterus wants a baby, but the woman doesn't have a baby inside. So what does the uterus do? It wants revenge. <laughs> Tiff. What? It's funny. Your body's punishing you with cramps. Thought that was you. Hide the wallets and silverware, Sam. Tiffany's in the house. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Tim. Hi, Tiffany. Sorry I woke you. You didn't wake me. I've been up for a bit. So how are we doing today, Miss Tiffany? Good, I guess. I mean, my mom yelled at me a lot yesterday. And I mean a lot. She was telling me how I was like grounded and whatnot, and she was gonna let me home alone, but then she thought that was a bad idea since her and my sister were going out for work the same day. And so now, I'm here. <laughs> now you're here. <laughs> What's this? My mom says chocolate's supposed to help with the cramps. Hey, Sammy Cat. I'll meet you in the other room. See ya, Mr. Tim. Bye, Tiff. That was nice of her, Mom. So did she say she's grounded today? But, she, well, it doesn't matter. She would have snuck out of the house and come over anyway, right? How you feeling? Better. Good. You want breakfast? I'll go get breakfast. Hey Sam, you know your mom used to beg me to get her these. And it's not easy being a guy, like, going to a store and trying to buy this kind of stuff. Light, regular, heavy. Yeah, I kind of became an expert when I was dating her. You know, I know I've been busy with work. Too busy. I'm really sorry that I, I didn't make you feel that I was there for you yesterday. Can't believe it's going to be two years. 18 months, three weeks, and four days. I miss her, Dad. I miss her, too. I want you to know you've been a good dad and mom. Well, you've been a good daughter and son. <laughs> Give me some knuckles. Your friend's weird. Yeah, she's a little stalker. But she's a keeper. Her and her mom were there for us when we needed them. 
Her mom's kind of cute, too. Dad. Samantha, code red! <laughs> Got you! You bunghole. Your mom and sister are right, attention stealer. I am not. Are too. What? Are you on your period? Girls! We'll see who comes running to you when you really get yours. Man, you're cranky when you have the war of Vietnam going on in your downstairs. Tiff. It's gross. At least I have a reason to be mean and cranky. What's your excuse? Well played, my friend. <laughs> I'm going to get breakfast now, for real.